Hello all, welcome back to the course Basic Signal Processing. I am Dr. Ravichandra Kulkarni. In the last video, we went through what is a subspace of a vector space and we took a small example of M2 cross 2 matrix. Now, uh, in order to take it on more with respect to matrices, so let us go through uh, four fundamental subspaces of a matrix. Uh, for uh, any matrix or an individual matrix, there are four fundamental subspaces of matrix vector space. We need to be uh, particular here that uh, this uh, mentions about uh, matrix vector space or talks about matrix vector space. So we have column space which is denoted by C of A, null space which is denoted by N of A, row space which is denoted by C of A transpose uh, and a left null space which is uh, denoted by N of A transpose. So uh, as the names of this uh, fundamental subspaces indicate that they are related to uh, columns or column vectors uh, linear combination of columns, null space, which means that there is something related to zero, row space, which is an, and as the symbol indicates, it is a transpose and something related to column matrix or column space, and uh, here left null space, which is again uh, transpose related. So just as a, a keywords, you can keep these in mind. Uh, and uh, we can take uh, one after the other so that we can understand more about these uh, four fundamental subspaces. Set of combinations of columns of A for the system AX equal to B. That is, for example, if I consider a 2 by 2 matrix 1, uh, 2, minus 1, and 3. And considering x1 and x2 to be the uh, variables and b being the solution side or the right hand side. So we say uh, for the system ax equal to b if we can express ax equal to b as something like this 1 2 times x1 plus minus 1 3 times x2 equals b1 b2 that is vector b then 1 2 and minus 1 3 the column vectors will be part of column space or will constitute column space of A. Column space would be V1 and sorry V2. V2. Right? Hope that is understood. If uh, we can express in this fashion then we can also declare that uh, ax equal to b has solutions or is solvable right so that makes the column space of a now uh, going further what is null space of a so if i have to consider uh, the set of all vectors such that ax equal to 0 that is our b vector is a null vector here so ax equal to 0 then we call that space or that set of vectors to be uh, null space of A. For example, for the same matrix which we took 1, where is that? 1, 2 and minus 1, 3. If I consider x1 and x2 as considered earlier, then equating this to 0, that is making Ax equal to 0 would mean uh, making 1 minus 1 and 2 into x1 x2 r2 b equal to 0 and 0 right which means mm, x1 minus x2 the row times into column 
and 2x1 plus 3x2 into 0. So from 1 and 2 we can say that x1 equal to x2 and if that is substituted in 2 we get 5x1 equals 0 and x1 equal to 0 which means x2 is equal to 0 then the solution set would be or the work would be 0 0 this is the null space of a hope the concept to start with is clear right now if i go ahead and uh, talk about the uh, row space row space that we defined it as column space of A transpose and if I have to write A transpose then it is 1, uh, one 2 and minus 1 3 right and the columns vectors would be V1 and V2 so here you see that minus 1 sorry 1 minus 1 and v2 as 2 v2 so these together constitute the column space or uh, sorry row space of uh, a right and left null space left null space is again it is null vector or null space of it is null space of a transpose which is again similar to what I did here so these four fundamental uh, sub subspaces of matrix space are important uh, in various uh, these four fundamental subspaces of matrix space or matrix vector space are important in order to do various uh, manipulations or various operations on the matrix uh, which is uh, predominantly used in signal processing, image processing, etc. So, uh, we will come back with uh, more uh, theory and we will discuss uh, different concepts related to uh, rank and echelon form, uh, row reduced echelon form and rank of the matrix in the next video. Uh, stay tuned and keep watching. The videos are kept short and uh, concept based so that uh, it is easier to go through specific concepts when needed rather than scrolling up and down uh, to that specific concept. So happy watching. Uh, we'll get back together soon.